So stop running down the spot. A few people should start joining, running down the spot. If you hear kids next door, it's Shay. Say hey, Shay. Hi. <laughs> start running down the spot. Okay, and then stretch jump. Nice big stretch jump, and then running on the spot again. Running, running. Re-angle it. Is it still? Is it Blairer? Eh? <laughs> yeah, I think I might have to do it. Do you want to do it over there? Huh? How blurry is it? Not as bad as it was the other day. Uh, just do it. Just do it. Strong the spot. Okay, let me see knees high. Knees up. Turn it. 14. Yay. Knees up nice and high. Running on the spot, guys. And then back to our stretch jump. So arms are nice and tall. Jumping off our toes. Jumping up, jumping up, jumping up. Okay, I'm running again. Kicking those bums, legs nice and back. Hitting your hands. Ooh. Warmer today. Uh, okay, start jumps. Arms out nice to the side, legs out. Ah, running again. A nice little jog. As soon as I clap my hands, I want you to run as fast as you can on the spot for 10 seconds. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm jumping on the spot. Then I have to put your arms up. Now swing your arms forwards and backwards. Could you hear me? Jogging, jogging, jogging. Okay, big circles with our arms. Big, big circles. And big circles backwards. Okay, I'm going to put both arms out in front. And you're going to make big circles the same way for. Keep going the same way. You're going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. And then you've got one arm going forwards, one arm going backwards. And keep circling. Okay. And then see if you can swap the ways that you're going. And it's going two forwards. <laughs> yes. Okay. It's two forwards, pal. <laughs> okay. Get nice and light on your feet. Bounce around a little bit. Like you're a boxer. Bounce around. Yeah. Okay, then we're going to go five tuck jumps. One, two, three, four, five. Bounce it. Bounce it. Five tuck jumps again. One, two, three, four, five. Bounce it. Bounce it. Okay, now we're going to try five pike jumps. So your feet are going to go right in front. One, two, Bouncy, three, four, and five, and bouncy. Okay, relax, relax, relax. Okay, and lean over one side. Lean nicely over all the way. Nice and warmed up. Should be out of breath by now. And then the other side. Lean right over. And circle your hips. Nice big circles of your hips. Okay, and now put our legs a bit further apart. Arms up nice and tall. And we're going to go from this position up five big circles. So you're going to go to the side, down to your foot, across, back up tall. And again, down, across, back up, down. Across, up, across, up, one more, across, and up. Now we're going to go the opposite way, all the way around, and up, and up, two more, 
Last one, keep those legs nice and straight, tense your legs. Up to, and then position two. So I'll reach out in front. Now we're gonna go one in front, two in the middle, three through your legs. So one, two, three. 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 And then arms out to the side. Bend forwards again. And then side to side, like an aeroplane. Keep those legs straight, keep them nice and stretched. We don't want to look like this while we're doing it. We want to be straight legs, straight arms. Okay, and then we're going to lunge to the right position like Spider-Man. Keep your chest up nice and tall and stay there. You want to be stretching that leg that's pointed out. Get that nice deep stretch in. And then the other side, stretch the other side. Keep your leg nice and straight, chest up nice and tall. Stretching your legs. You want to be stretching this muscle over here. It's called your hamstring. Okay, and then both legs straight again. Hold in the middle. Yeah, okay, now we're going to go five times from this position. Put your hands together. I want you to squat down, and then you're going to jump up. Squat down, jump up five times. Ten times, actually. Four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good, and feet together. Arms up nice and tall for me. And we're going to go push our bums back. Reach towards the ground. Go as far as you can until you feel a stretch on your legs. And then hold. If you can, get your, toe, your fingers on the floor. If you can get your fingers on the floor, get your hands on the floor. Push those legs nice and straight. And hold him. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And squat down for me. We're going to bounce. 1, 2, 3. Straighten up for 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Come down. Okay, now stand on your fingers. See if you can stand on your fingers. Get your legs as straight as you can. So one, two, three, five, four, three, two, one, and come back down. Now show me a straddle shape. Is that a straddle shape correct? Yes, yes of course it is. Okay, hands in front. What we need to do, we're going to reach out forwards as far as you can and then come back. Then we're going to put both our hands. Either side of our right leg, then slide forwards, and then go to our left. So hands either side, forwards. So we reach one forward, two to our right, then to our left, forward, to our right, to our left. Now two forwards, one, two, two to our right, one, two, two to our left, one, two, two forwards, one. Two, two to my right, one, two, then to our left, one, two, last one, forwards twice, one, two, then to our right, one, two, then to our left, one, two, yeah, okay, now hold out in front, as far forwards as you can, really stretching all of this, all these muscles on the inside of your leg, reaching forwards. Oh, good, and then over to your right foot. Reach as far forwards as you can. Try and get your nose to your knee if you can. Grab your foot, reaching forwards. You should be hurting, yeah. You're getting more flexible, stretching it. Okay, then over to your left. Grab your left foot and pull on your foot if you can. Try and get your nose to your knee. Grab your foot, nose to your knee. Good, and then once more, forwards twice, then to our right. You should be able to get a little bit lower this time. And then to the left. Okay, and then into a tip shape for me. And grab onto your toes. What I want you to do now, grab it onto your toes. Walk your feet out as far as you can. Keep walking, keep walking, keep walking, keep walking. If you can get your legs straight, and then pull your toes up if you can. 
If you're super flexible, try and grab your heels. Not to say that I'm super flexible. And try and get your head into your feet. Legs together. Good, keep going. Grab those toes if you can't. Really stretch the back of your legs. Now and then to butterfly. So bring both feet in. And uh, you're going to flap your wings. Flap, 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 flap. <laughs> and then reach your hands as far forwards as you can. Go as far forwards as you can. Yeah. Okay, then into a tuck check for me. We are going to do my favourite. Said nobody is a bridge. Who we got in the chat today? Who we got? Hello, Phoebe. Hello, Charlie, Evie, Kelsey, Lexi, Connie, and Cleo. In sparkling, in spalding, in sparkling. Yeah. Today, guys, I'm not streaming on Facebook today. So anyone that's came from Facebook, make sure you hit that nice subscribe button. What we're going to do, we're going to do some chest workouts. So we're going to do some press-ups, planks. You guys follow along. You just copy me and Hannah. Are you ready, Hannah? <laughs> do that. There we go. Mm -hmm. Repping the Wolf Run t-shirts today. Yeah, we are. If no one knows what a Wolf Run t-shirt is, Google it. You'll be impressed. Alpha. <laughs> Uh, Alpha. Alpha. Right, first exercise, we're going to go. Mm, how many times? We can move between five and ten, Emma. Nine. Nine. Nine times. What I want you to do, you're going to reach down front of the pipe, walk your hands out as far forwards as you can into your press up position. We're going to go down, up, and then walk all the way back up. Nine times. Let's have a bit. Yay. Arms up. So, left of each one. Down, walk forwards, press up, backwards. Arms up. Three. <laughs> you should not have picked nine. Help it. It's helping. Four. Five. I said we were going to do bridges and then change my mind. Yes, you did. <laughs> Backwards. Because we're not finished stretching pipe yet. Six. Six. Seven. It's nothing. I just needed to get a bit more ready for bridge. Eight. Eight. Last one. Last one. Last one. That's what I want to hear. I want to hear Hannah talking. Ah, no. Ah, stress. Huh? And now we can do a bridge. Yes. Let's go. Back in the position. Everyone down on the floor. We're going to go 30 seconds in bridge. Three, two. So, remember your bridge. Took your feet in nicely. Fold your arms behind your head. Back a nice crack if you're old like me. You're getting old. That is even older. Three, two, one, and push up. There's a second. He's counting. 25, 24, 23, 22, 31, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax. Into a tuck shape and rock forwards and backwards. Oh, that is a good stretch. Guys, if you stick around till the end, I'm going to try a backwards walk over again, <laughs> which is always fun. So rocking forwards and backwards for me. This time, we're going to push up again. Remember, if this is easy for you, rock forwards and backwards is one option. 
The second option is to lift your leg up. If you're very, very good, lift your leg up and rock, or if you can, tip top so you're kicking over, kicking back to bridge, okay? Are we ready? 20 seconds this time. Three, two, one, go. 20 seconds, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax, relax, relax. Back into a tuck shape, rocking your back, forwards and back, and stretching your back the other way. Woo. <laughs> okay, stretch out, have a little breather, stretch your wrists, stretch your neck, warm up your back, keep bending your wrists forwards, backwards, forwards, backwards, who we got, who we got, hello from Ava and Annabelle, you caught me at the right time for a shout out, okay let's go on to our stomach, Stretching. Ooh. Have a nice day. Okay. The proper word for this one's child pose. We so learned from yoga. We learned from doing yoga yesterday. So you're going to lean back, <laughs> go onto your fingertips, try and push your armpits into the floor. Really trying to stretch your shoulders out. So we're going from there. Really stretch it and then back forwards. Try and get your toes to touch your head at the back. Okay. And lean back once more. Fingertips. Try and push your shoulders into the floor. Okay, now what we're going to do, I want you to go into that press up position. So stretch your wrists out if your wrists are hurting. Mine are a little bit sore today from the bridges we did in our last class. Oh. Okay, everybody into a front support. We're going to hold a front support for 20 seconds. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Lifting up. You don't want your bum up really tall. And you don't want your bum up really low. You want to be holding 20, 19, no, 18, just 17, again. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Now don't, don't relax, still hold. You're going to lift onto one arm and bring your other arm up and hold for 20. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Now don't relax again. Put this hand back down. We're going to swap over to the other side. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax. Shake those shoulders. You should have felt the, the muscles working in your shoulders then. Have a little relax. Ooh. Okay, I want to quickly say thank you to everyone. Everyone that got joined in on our Frog Balance Challenge. Massive well done. We had quite a few entries in. Massive well done to Charlie Hurst for coming first. She held it for well over a minute. So let's try and beat Charlie now.
Okay, we're all going to do front balances together. Let's see if I can beat Hannah. So oh, Hannah can beat me. <laughs> are we ready? So, you want to squat down on the floor with your knees apart, hands in the middle. You're going to have your knees rest onto your elbows, leaning forwards, and you're going to try and lift your feet off the floor. Okay, let's try and do it. You ready, Hannah? Yeah. Three, two, one, lean forward, lift those toes up off the floor, and we're holding. No! <laughs> we're holding. As long as you can, keep going. <laughs> if you fall down, shake your wrist, shake your wrist, try again. So we're holding. Hold it. We'll come back out. Stretch your wrists, stretch your arms, hold it. <laughs> Keep holding. Last try. One more time. As long as you can. Definitely not a minute. Three, two, one. Go. Just go wonky. Got one weak arm. Wonky eye. Sure wonky. <laughs> now relax. Okay, keep stretch. Stretch your wrists out. You guys can keep trying. If you can keep doing it, keep doing it. Did anybody hold it for the whole of that? If anyone held it for less than it, more than a minute. Send it to me. You never know, you might get a nice little prize. Okay, my little challenge for you, we're going to go from that frog balance into a headstand. So I want you to be really careful with this one. Careful of your head. Put a cushion in front of you if you need it. First one, just to a tuck shape. So you're going to do your frog balance. I want you to try and hold your frog balance for five seconds. Are you ready? So from here, we go five, four, three, two, one, then lift our head forward, and we're in this position. Yeah, knees on your elbows. Then we're going to try and lift both of our legs into tuck, and then straighten up if you can. If you can, from here, come back down, knees on your elbows, and back to your frog balance, and stand up. Okay, keep trying it. Hannah will give it another go. Josh is getting tired. No, I'm not. I'm never tired. Never ever. Who we got in the chat? Alana and little brother Charlie. Hello. Hey, Neve. And hey, Maddie. Maddie used to be, well, is my coach. Maddie's in the chat. We have Neve. So remember, your hands need to be further back than your head. And then you're trying to bring your legs back down into that frog balance. Okay, try it. I'm going to give it another go. Yeah, you are. Try to keep working, keep working. This is going to be very, very good for any of your handstands, any of your headstands. So from here, lift it up, head down, tuck shape, and up. And back down. Frog balance. Okay. Keep trying it. Keep going with it. Keep doing it. Let's see who we got in the chat. Frog balance. Headstand. Back down to frog balance. See if you can hold it back. It's holding the frog balance after that's very hard. It really didn't do that. I'll be impressed. Go on then. I can't hold it after it's on my feet. So knees on the outside of your elbows. You're going to lift to frog balance. Hold for five. Then your head's going to go to the floor. We're going to try and lift up. Careful of lifting up. Legs nice and straight. Slowly is better than speedily. Speedy. Controlled. We want elegance. You get to here. Lean back. No. So she's got to keep her shoulders forward. She drops her shoulders back. That's why you're not holding it. Yeah? Try again. Do it again. I'll do it again. You guys keep working as well, trying to do frog balance headstand. Do it. Good. Now keep your shoulders forward as you come in your frog balance. So shoulders forward, it's like a press handstand. There you go. You held it. Let's try it. Let me try it. From here. Front balance. Headstand. Do it. Back down, onto my knees, from here, left, hold it, no. 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> keep trying. You're going to try that. Keep going. Keep going. We're going to move on in two minutes to our next exercise. Keep trying. I'm going to look at the chat. See who we got. Keep trying. Keep trying it, Hannah. Very good. Okay, let's move forward. So you got your front balance like that. That is a good, good progression to build all of your muscles in your shoulders for your lift to handstand. Okay. Another exercise that I want you guys to practice. So this is your homework for the weekend. You're going to go in a straddled position. So bring your legs out as far, far, not super far. You're not doing box splits. Okay. We're going to go from here. You're going to reach into that straddle position. Try and put your hands in line with your feet. So Hannah's doing it that way so you guys should be able to see if the camera quality is not as bad as Wednesday. <laughs> okay? You're going to put your hands in the middle. Of. So your palms in line with your feet. So your toes. Yeah. And so then you're from, not in between them, you're a bit in front of your yeah. feet. So you're, the back of your hands are in line with your toes. And then from here, you're going to lift your shot, lift. You're going to lift your shoulders forward. And I want you to try and come up onto your tippy toes. And come back down. So you should feel all of that strain in your shoulders. Okay? So from here, hands on the floor, shoulders forwards, and onto your tiptoes, back down. And back forwards, onto your tiptoes, and come back down. Do it ten times for me. So forward, tiptoes, and back down. You want to push the floor away. So from there, push. Down. Shoulders forward. Up off the toes, back down. Okay, keep going, do it 10 times for me. So from here, your shoulders are lifting really, really far forward. If you can, bring your toes up just slightly. So lift them off and then bring them back down. Okay, so forwards, toes come up, bring them back down. Yeah, forwards, toes up, bring them back down. Okay, keep you going, keep going. Okay, next one that you guys are going to do. So you do that one for 10 times. Then 10 times I want you to travel with it. So going forwards. There you go there. Toes forwards. Reach your hands further forwards. Go, go, go. So straddle. Hands down. Tippy toes. And lift forward a little bit. There. Tippy toes. Lift forward. Tippy toes. Lift forward. Tippy toes. Forward. You go, keep practicing it. Okay. If you're not putting any effort in, you're not going to get better, Connie. <laughs> so reaching forward, holding forward, tippy toes. Yeah. Yeah, that's, what you got. that's the whole point of it. Yeah. So you're getting that resistance stronger in your shoulders, ready for a lift to handstand. Okay? Do you want more, Hannah? Tippy toes. Leaning forwards, tippy toes. Oh, hi. Good. Right, so... Those exercises, I want you to practice all of these over the weekend, okay? My next class is Monday, 2 o'clock. But over the weekend, you guys can all practice. You've got that one that you were doing, which is moving, okay? Exercise one, straddle, tippy toes, lifting forward. Straddle, tippy toes, lifting forwards. If you can't quite bring your feet forwards, then I want you to practice it standing. So from here, straddle, tippy toes, and back like down. Okay, do it 10 times, have a little rest, do another 10, 10 times, do a little rest. Okay, your other one to practice over the weekend is frog balance. Anna's very good at that one, she can demonstrate that one. 
Somebody's wrist is hurting. <laughs> so forward. Holding it. Trying to hold it for as long as Charlie has. We did it for well over a minute. Okay? If you can, next exercise is trying to go into your headstand. Okay, and then if you can't get to your front balance, Hannah's going to get better at this over the weekend because I'm going to make her practice. We go from there, trying to come back in to our front balance. Holding the front balance. And holding the front balance. Okay? They're all your gymnastics exercises to, to work on over the weekend. Okay? Now, let's do some stretching to finish up. As you might have noticed, we didn't do splits at the start. So, everyone onto their knees for me. Right leg forwards for me. Keep this leg nice and straight. And I want you to reach forward as far forwards as you can. Just stretch out. Your split should be better now than at the end of the session than at the beginning. So your blood's got pumping around your body and you're ready and prepared so you should be more flexible. Okay, lunge forwards to try and get this back leg straight and lift up. Okay. And then we're going to slide forwards as far down as we can to that split position. And hold. Try and hold there. If you can, arms out to the side, arms up. Any way you can. Okay, and come back. Stretch that front leg. Really feel it, really deep. It should be hurting, but you've got to put up with that pain if you want to get better. Okay, and then lunge forward. Stretch that back leg out. Good, okay, and then shake your legs off. Shake your legs. Give them a good shake now. Put your left leg forward. Same again, so reaching forward. Stretch that back leg out. Really feel it stretch. Keep it nice and straight. And then lunge forwards with your back leg straight. Keep it nice and straight. Okay, and lunge forwards as far as you can. Stretch and right down to splits. And hold. Count arms out. Arms up if you can. And hold in there. 50. 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, and stand up. Your legs are good shake. Shake them out. Ooh, I did that. I did that for the first one. Maybe I did that for the second one. That's going to get a little bit nervous on live camera because it's not normal, is it? Sorry. Right. <laughs> okay, legs out to the side. And then you're going to walk or crunch your toes so you're going out further. And further and further and further and further when you can. Reach your hands down towards the floor. And stretch as far as you can. If you can, elbows to the floor. Or better yet, get your chest on the floor. <laughs> and stretch. Stretch it, stretch it, stretch it. Ah, together. Give your wrists a nice stretch. Give them a good stretch. Right. Thank you ever so much for joining us. That should have got you nice and pumped up, gave you some activities to work on. Obviously, there's a lot more to work on, okay? A lot more classes to come on. I just wanted to break it down a bit basic today, okay? Like I promised, I'll try my back and talk over again. See if it's, you guys let me know in the comments if it's better than my last class. I feel a bit, feel a bit more, more loose today. Okay, do I have to do it from back then? You might as well. Don't try and hop, just try and just kick. Don't try and do it up one leg. You want to show us a good one? It won't be good right now. <laughs> Anna will show first, and then I'm going to give it a go. And then we're going to finish on this live stream. 
So I'm about to try a knife back and talk over that I can teach. I'm going to do a back bend then kick over because I'm not going to be able to do it. So back bend, and she's kicking over. Easy peasy. I'm going to do it just as easy. Are we ready? Ready for a laugh. Ready for a good laugh on a Friday. Is it Friday? It's Friday. I don't need rock and pedal to be used to kick. Yeah, if you didn't have socks on, you might have been alright. Right. right. Try it just for the kick, and then I'm done. Get your feet in as close to your hands. No, I'm not embarrassing myself on the internet anymore. Get your feet in closer. Don't rock, just go for a big kick. Go on, really push. Oh. Ah, that's it. <laughs> right, guys, thank you very, very much for joining me today. I'll be back on a mon on Monday at two o'clock. Monday at two. If you've not yet hit that subscribe button, please hit that subscribe button. If I get to a thousand subscribers, my quality of the video is going to improve massively because I can use this and this camera is better than this camera. Okay. Thank you very much for joining us. See you on Monday. See you on Monday. Bye. I can't see.